Hello there and welcome to my channel once again. I presume we're learning every time that you're coming to this channel. And um, it's very nice to see you once again here. So, it's been a journey that we started several weeks ago, a few weeks ago, not several actually, a few weeks ago. And uh, I decided to do simple trainings, tutorials on how to get ourselves equipped with the Canva gra graphic design because I am a graphic designer. Some of the things that I find there that are very interesting are uh, platforms like Canva and I decided to take, an to take this chance to actually take you through how to use designs using a free tool like Canva. So Canva is also used on mobile phone. It's a web application. It's also an Android and iOS. So you can use it. You don't have any excuse. You don't have a computer. You can use it on your smartphone. Because pro provided you have a stable internet, you can still do the same same kind of designs that we'll be doing through these trainings. So last time we did a resume, professional resume, minimalistic form. And uh, the things that I, I, I didn't mention because of time. And today I wanted to make it a little bit simple, uh, short, by the way. I didn't say, I didn't... Like I didn't highlight about if you're making a resume, you need to also do a cover letter. So a cover letter is just what other people say an application letter, but it's just a profile of yourself. So in 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 a in in a, is it a prose or paragraph paragraphical form? I don't know if that is even an English term. So you need to also have a cover letter in addition to a CV or a resume. So those two work go hand in hand together so today i d i don't want to go back to that kind because we already d did a, a cv and the same same way you can do a cover letter by going to documents and finding the a4 or letter document and then you take that so today i wanted us to do something different <laughs> we are doing a presentation we will be going to marketing much talking let's go to the designs so um when you come to this uh, canva on our home there's a presentation section under documents category so you click presentation it will take you direct to this kind of uh, our edit preview windows we have our canvas here that is already selected you can add pages but today we want to work with the template so on as usual left hand side of our window we will see our designs and they are categorized into specific uh, categories so we have marketing presentation brainstorming presentations you know when you're doing a training on brainstorming and those kind of discussions company presentation you, you have a company you have a business brand guideline presentation they are very beautiful look at those kind of designs so let's take for example this uh, let's take for example hmm, business presentation you find a lot of different formats there and they are pre-made so just take it customize it to your own desire you can take this other one so um there's an option of when you click that uh, when you select rather when you select that business presentation you take one that you like you can click apply all 16 pages by clicking just once all the pages will be applied there automatically so you can see them on our canvas they are already there and when you click command command minus for reducing the size of the window you will see that all our 16 pages are there and you can change it to your specific desired titling texts and all those kind of other details so this is one of the designs that you can come and change you can add the team that you work with their titles you can change the colors by selecting the background coming to colors you know so you look at something that you like and then you can customize to your own needs i think my network is not loading fast enough today 
Hmm. So that's one of the templates. You can go back to the templates and then check another one under the business. We have. Uh, when I come to this, I can check. Uh, let's say we have a visual ads presentation. Visual chats not ads. So when you click that, and then let's say you want to take statistics, look at those kind of designs. This for you to get this kind of designs on Microsoft Office. I don't know. It is going to be very difficult. It takes time. Like it takes hours. But this one you can just do it within the shortest possible duration that you have. Customize it. And it's very simple by the way. The way we the way Microsoft PowerPoint works with Excel is similar to how this uh, platform this Canva has been programmed. So like this one, this chart here, when you when you double click on it. I think when you double click on the figures, I think uh, edit something. Mm, not here, not here. Let's come to this chart. Yeah, I, I meant this one. So when you come to this one, this donut design, it will double click and then it brings on the left, on the left side of uh, the window. Here you'll find that. You can choose an option whether you want a donut, whether you want a pie. You can choose whether you want an area chart, whether you want a line art, whether you want a row, whether you want bar, you know, those kind of things. So we'll go back to our donut and then you see this, these items. So right now they're just two, two items, item one and item two, 42 and 58. So you can add item three, for example, and then let's say let's say this one will be 12 of course it will be more so when you say 12 it will have to reduce this other one so automatically it does the calculations for you this one is 51 this is 37 this is 10 point so item 4 item 4 and then let's say you put 10 automatically it adds and it adjusts it for you now another thing is that you can you know it's presenting it into percentages but here you can put your figures you see he put the we put first 58 and 42 now we've added we've added you can whichever number you want to put you'll put it and it will it will do the calculations for you so it will do which one is bigger and then it gives it this the, the highest percentage so that is one one way of doing work working out with this see this one here you click it will show you select it so and then it shows you that it's a line chart and then it is having this kind of figures one up to whichever and you can edit if you want to maybe put it e it will change that it will put it e you want to put it maybe z whichever figures you want to put it will whichever terminologies you're using depending on your on your specific uh kind of designs that you want um so this is it this is one of it uh it's under that under that kind of beautiful designs so um these are some of the few things you can do that you cannot do on other platforms but canva gives you the opportunity to do that so let's say we have already done and then how you export you want to present it you can see just preview how it, it will look like it will show you this is how it looks like then you click the next one it shows you even with the animations these are the animations these are the data this is how the data moves this is how you see very nicely done how you do this in powerpoint for me it's a bit difficult i don't know but here on canva it's very fast and easy um so you can see very nicely done then you, you go escape key and then you come out. So that is an, a presentation uh, example. So if you want to download it, you click on this arrow that is pointing downwards, you download it as PDF. But if you want to download it as Microsoft PowerPoint format, you click on these three dots at the corner of the right, every corner, right corner, three dots, the corner right of the screen. <laughs> And then it will bring you this option for sharing. Then you can share as PowerPoint. You can also share it in these other different platforms. So that is it with 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 the PowerPoint presentations.
you can come on this platform and do more as much as you continue using this kind of platform you'll better your skills in design in future because we are starting from the basic level using this digital platform so that you understand the basic basic levels of design the type of designs that are trending are already here and then we'll do similar designs now with the professional tools like photoshop as as usual when you come to this particular channel and you like these kind of videos consider subscribing consider sharing these kind of videos to many people as possible so that it reaches many people who are in need of such kind of information and knowledge people, many people don't even know these platforms exist so they still want to use the default uh, programs when we have faster simpler uh, technology that is there and it's also on the phone canva.com you can uh, you can download this as, as, a, as a mobile application instead of on your phone and then you can do similar designs and be able to do it faster so i will not talk much till we meet again share subscribe and comment on what else you want to learn on this kind of channel thank you